Hello, beloved. It's me, Robin. Robin Hallett, intuitive healer and light sparkler at robinhallett.com. I'm checking in today with a beautiful guided meditation for you. One that will hopefully help you have courage and choose your own heart, your delight, your joy, your sense of fun and adventure and like so many people who write to me every single week say, feel like I am doing my life right. I want to feel like I know what I'm doing. I want to feel alive and lit up and juicy and happy and excited for every day like it's a beautiful adventure. So if that's you too, because so many of us are in that boat, let's go. Let's do this. So if it feels right, you know, you can place your hands like this or place them over your high heart or place them on your belly, however you're receiving. If you're in the you know, car and listening or whatever you're doing, just connect with your deepest self, your, your highest self, your deepest self. And I'm going to close my eyes too and let's say a little prayer and an intention. I ask that the guides and angels who walk with my friend here stand present witness for us in this healing, in this guided meditation today. I ask that we feel empowered, emboldened, encouraged to take a beautiful step forward in our own journey today, now, in this moment. I, I call forward the energy that my friend has been sitting with here. You know that stuff, the stagnant, fearful, stuck stuff, the stuff that feels like you are never going to be free, you're never gonna make it, you're never gonna make anything of yourself, you know that stuff. I call forward this stuff and I lay it on this beautiful altar. I ask that it be transformed now. And you can pause this and take your time at this part. You know, you don't have to rush yourself along. You can pause and allow yourself to lay all the things that you struggle with on a daily basis, small and large, on this altar for yourself right now, okay? I ask that all of us, our self-judgment, our fear of failure, our worry that we're not doing life right, our deep concern and misunderstanding about money, <laughs> um, our physical appearance, our age, our weight, all these stories we carry that seem to be the reason we are not wherever we say we want to be. I ask that we lay these on this beautiful altar. Now friends, I haven't told you what this gorgeous altar is. It's a beautiful crystal altar, the most sparkling kind made of the deepest gemstones from the center of the earth, the core, you know, the mantle of the earth risen up from that space, empowered with so much receiving gravity that anything you choose to lay on this altar, power, it's going to be powerful. If you're willingly giving it up, it's going to be received and transformed. So I ask that these things we have laid on this altar are transformed into energy and light and power that we may feel able to move forward in the direction of our deepest longings that we may feel encouraged and inspired 
And instead of saying it hasn't happened, it can't happen, it's too late, that we start believing in our possibility and our now. You know, there's only now, only ever now. And the past, it just doesn't matter. Now is always new. That's what I love to say. Now is always new. And so now, if it feels right, you know, raise your arms high and call this energy in, this healing, beautiful energy, healing, I said possibility, miracles, the energy that lives in the truest vortex of your being. Call it in, call it down, pull it down through each of your chakras each of your energy centers. Call it into your most highest self and your lowest functioning self. Because And who, uh, seriously, who doesn't have that self? Seriously, we all do. Don't feel bad about that. Don't feel bad. Don't apologize for him or her. Just allow the healing light to enter, okay? And if you're watching me now, I'm, I'm swooping my hands. Swooping, 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 just down over my body. You probably see a little paint on my hands because I've been painting and doing things I love a little bit every day because I don't want to quit on little Robbie, little Robin girl who loves to have so much fun and play and just know that life is for her and it's fun and all is well and everything's possible. So... May this also serve you in the deepest and best way ever, 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 ever. You are loved. You are cherished. You are a sacred gem. You know, my prayer is you treat yourself the same way that I see you. And always, if I can help, send me an email. Hello at RobinHallett.com. I'll put some links below so we can connect further. And, you know, just big love from my heart to yours. Okay? It's Robin signing off. Ciao. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye. Now I'm signing off.